Hello everyone, welcome to my review of the brand new CCM 450 Adventure, my new motorcycle for the season 2015. It's 1st of March 2015 today and fortunately this winter has been quite short in Sweden. All the snow is mostly gone, at least here around Stockholm. So I'll go out for my very first ride today. And actually that bike is so new I haven't even started up the engine yet. So that's gonna happen first time today. But first let me show some of the details and accessories which I have ordered with that bike. You see here the adjustment for the windscreen. Um, this makes it possible to adjust the windscreen approximately, well, I would guess 10-15 centimeters up and down and also adjust the angle. I haven't tried that yet. I've of course also ordered the stainless steel radiator guard to protect the bike's radiator from flying stones, quite important and a very stable looking 4mm aluminum engine guard. Um, you can also see I have ordered the adjustment, the manual adjustment for the rear suspension. There is also an electronic adjustment available but that is quite expensive. The manual adjustment simply works with, an, with a wheel on the left hand side of the engine where you can set the uh, preload and of course uh, the complete suspension on the bike is fully adjustable so also rebound dampening and all the other um, adjustments can be done. Um, I've also ordered a luggage system, it's that one for the soft bags because I will not be using those aluminium boxes but only soft bags on that so that should work quite nicely. But what is missing actually in the empty room here is a um, exhaust dummy uh, storage container which gives you the possibility to have approximately 4 liters of storage room, 4 tools and spare parts. Down here on the left hand side the orange thing you see is that's the adjustment wheel for the preload of the back damper. Um, also quite nice mainly in our Scandinavian weather of course are the heated grips. Some people in Germany are laughing about them but actually if you're riding here big parts of the reason at 5 degrees or even less um, then uh, heated grips are really a nice accessory. And you see also that I have mounted different tires just yesterday because once the snow is really gone on the forest and logging roads it will be very wet out there and those um, road oriented tires that the bikes comes with will not be of much use out there. So these tires are Pirelli MT21 Rally Rate which I'm actually trying also the very first time. So folks, and now I'm really excited because as I said I haven't even started the engine yet. I want to break in the engine the right way. So this is going to be the very first time that I hit the button there and hope it fires up. Um, I got the bike about four, five weeks ago at the Stockholm Motorcycle Show and since then it's been waiting in my garage for that final day today when both the registration is done and the insurance is valid. So I will go out for my very first ride today on the CCM 450. So, Let's see if she starts up. Exciting.
So you see, this is why I can't show you more off-road riding today. There's still a lot of snow and ice and I really don't want to crash the bike. It's brand new, it doesn't have any protection here on the corners, which will get the impact first if you hit the ground. So I need to get some uh, protective bars first before I'm trying stuff like that. And you all know, without dubs, dub tires, studded tires, this is, uh, I don't want to say suicidal, but quiet, quiet, slippy. out about two hours now and did about a hundred kilometers and also if, as you see it's quite windy about five degrees so not really motorcycle weather but of course great fun and I really love being out again first ride in 2015 so how's the bike well I really like it um, when I started I thought it's a bit vibey but those vibrations are going to get less that's what everybody says when the engine is running and I think it's not more YB than my 690 Enduro, which is also a big one-cylinder bike and you will never have a one-cylinder bike which runs totally vibration-free. Simply impossible. But those vibrations are not so much a, a problem, mainly because I'm standing on small roads and I'm always varying the speed and the, the turns per minute, the engine, so really not a big deal. Um, the only other negative point which I've figured out but I, have, but I have a little problem with is the gear lever which I think is a bit too short maybe. I might want to have a longer one to get my foot probably under it. But otherwise this bike is pure fun. It's really light. It's just great if you have these small curvy roads and the gravel stuff. Um, I think we're going to have a great season this year 2015 together. Um, I'm planning a lot of gravel riding uh, over the summer just already starting in April with a tour to Gotland and uh, in May in Finland and in June, July in Sweden and Norway. Um, actually on this Norway trip all the three uh, in Sweden sold CCM 450s will be present. So CCM will be dominating the Till Tops event this year. Um, so I can really recommend it and uh, see you later. I just need to warm up now.